Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Fallout 4, and I'm going to be showing you guys today how to get Kermva's Tooth, or something's Tooth. Um, it's a legendary melee weapon, sword type, uh, type of weapon. So, you're going to be in Dun, or whatever, the, uh, the Dunwich Borers, like, um, like in the last video where I showed you that power armor. So you're going to be down here. Um, and it's pretty linear to this point right here where you'll get down to the bottom and you'll reach this door right here. It'll be chained. You'll go ahead and pop it open and you'll come into this room. Uh, and you'll head down this way. There is some teleportation to this. It just moves you to different areas. But essentially, you're just going to get teleported back to relatively the same area. It's just going to put you in a different spot to try to confuse you, I guess. Uh, but then eventually, you will get to this opening. You want to head up this. Um, and then, once again, it will teleport you around into these rooms. But essentially, you just want to move this way. And uh, this is kind of the confusing part because there is this up part. Don't go that way. There's nothing there. Um, if you come down here, uh, you will get to this point. You'll get to the number four. The sneak bobblehead will be sitting right here if you have not got it. That's where it will be sitting. Then you want to head through this opening right here. And you'll walk down here and initially you'll see kind of an illusion um, of like a ritual going on that it will you'll walk close enough and it'll teleport you to this spot right here um, it's like a mirage almost and then you'll need to kill those ghouls what you want to do is you want to jump into this water swim down head through this opening right here and you will see this is kind of where they were worshiping at this shrine Here's Kremva's Tooth. We'll pick up the mini nukes first. You get two mini nukes. Why not take those? But here it is. Kremva's Tooth. Uh, target bleeding and are poisoned. Targets bleed and are poisoned. There we go. Exceptional damage. Does 38. And uh, I think that's three bleeding damage. It's got medium speed. Low weight. Uh, Sacrificial Blade is its current mod. Uh, but I thought this was a cool... Uh, unique legendary weapons so i thought i'd show you guys it's a little confusing if you don't do it from if i can't really show you from the beginning um because it's it's just confu it's just you just continue to walk just continue to keep moving um through the different i don't know if they're mirages or if they're teleports or whatever they are but just keep on moving through them and eventually you'll get to um, this open room and then I believe you get teleported one more time before you actually get to this hallway Then you move down the hallway and then you'll get that mirage again And then you'll have to kill there is a decent amount of feral ghouls down here. I actually found two legendaries um, Ghouls down here, so that's always really nice. There is a bunch of cigarettes down here So go ahead and pick those up for your selling purposes even though I don't need them whatsoever uh, But I just thought I'd show you guys this um, I may be finding a lot of unique and legendary weapons since I'm still need to get ten more bobbleheads uh and so that means they're probably in 10 locations i haven't been to so that means i might be able to show you guys 10 new items or 10 power armor locations or oh you know a mix but i hope you guys enjoyed this video go go ahead and get yourself this melee weapon i think i'm going to actually start doing melee weapon a little bit because i never play melee weapons in this game and i actually really like this i'll go ahead and put it on so you guys can see what it looks like um there it is and so here it is. It actually looks really cool in my opinion. What I really wish they'd let you do in Fallout is dual wield swords or dual wield melee weapons or dual wield pistols. That would also be really cool. Um, but you can't. Uh, you're stuck with your one, but I actually like this. It actually looks pretty cool in my honest opinion. Um, we can see here, actually, now that's armor. Is there a weapon? No. Of course. Of course it's armor. Of course there's not a weapons bench. Um, but it is cool. It's got kind of, it's got a decent, um, moveset, the decent slashing. Um, it doesn't have, like, a weird slash to it, like, uh, a couple weapons I know do have, like, a weird slash. Or it's hard to hit. This is just a nice diagonal slash in both directions. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys in my next Fallout 4 video. Peace out!